Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on Real Life Negative Numbers Worksheet. Using your knowledge of negative numbers, solve each of the following problems. So this video just gives us four problems to solve, so it's just a, like a worksheet. And this is an example of four real life situations where negative numbers occur. And we're just asked to solve each of those problems. Now if you're not sure what to do, there is a lesson on this very topic and on the next slide you'll be invited to click on a link and it will take you to the lesson and it will explain how to do all these examples. Let's quickly see what's required for all of the examples. Number one, I have $432 in my bank account. Then I withdraw $157 to buy groceries. The next day my employer deposited $398 into my account. What is the current balance? So there are examples there where negative numbers come into play. So we have to perform a calculation to solve this problem and that will highlight the importance of negative numbers for that particular example. Example 2. A helicopter is hovering at 152 metres above a lake. It needs to lift a stranded fisherman to safety because his boat has broken down. It drops 127 metres so that it can get closer because the cable in the helicopter is not long enough. How far above the lake is it now? So here's another perfect example of negative numbers coming into play. So you have to perform a calculation to find the answer. And there is a negative number involved. Example 3. During a particular day the temperature fluctuates regularly. The day started at 37 degrees. A cold change came and the temperature fell 9 degrees in the next hour. One hour later it fell a further 4 degrees before increasing by 5 degrees later in the day. What was the temperature after the 5 degree increase? So here we have some negative numbers also. Another very practical everyday example. And for the last one, Billy had 831 marbles in a bag. He gave 156 to Harry. After that he gave another 398 to his sister Mary. How many did he have left? So this video has presented four everyday examples to demonstrate the importance of negative numbers in real life and if you're not sure how to approach these problems on the next slide there is a link if you click on the link it will take you to the lesson and it will show you how to do all these examples.